nutrients. Newborn meter with extra nutrients makes you taller and healthier. What does nutrition mean? I will ask Preeti ma'am tomorrow. What is this nutrition? Ravi, why are you not concentrating in the class? What are you thinking about? Ma'am, what is this nutrition? My mother always keeps shouting at me that I should eat nutritious food and have a balanced diet. Don't get confused, Ravi. I'll explain. The food we eat every day consists of several nutrients. Nutrients are the chemical substances present in the food which provide energy and material needed by the body to live and grow. Test for starch. Let us find out by a simple activity that leaves contain starch. Remove a green leaf from a plant and put it in a beaker half filled with water. Heat the water until it boils. Now remove the leaf and put it in the test tube and heat the test tube in the beaker till the leaf decolorizes. Take out the leaf and put it in the beaker for a while. And then spread the leaf evenly on a petri dish. Add a few drops of iodine or potassium iodide solution to the leaf and note the observations. What will you see? Any guesses? Yes, you are right. Leaf color changes into blue-black and that indicates the presence of starch in leaves. Test for proteins in food. Let us carry out an experiment which confirms the presence of protein. Let's take kidney beans. Grind the beans and add its powder in a test tube. Now add water to it. Well, now put a few drops of caustic soda, followed by few drops of copper sulfate solution to the mixture. Shake the contents of the test tube and observe the change. You will find that the color of the solution changed to pink. This confirms the presence of proteins in kidney beans. Potato contains carbohydrates. Brown nut contains fats. Hence, cannot be used for the test. Test for fats. Take a white paper and rub a piece of butter over it. Now bring it in front of a lighted candle. What do you observe? You see the light faintly through the paper. This is because the paper has an oily patch. The food item, that is the butter, contains fats, protective food, vitamins and minerals. Ravi, you did not finish your lunch. I don't like to eat green vegetables. Okay, from tomorrow, I will not give you any green vegetables. Mom, I couldn't win the first prize because of my illness. Son, I have already told you to eat green vegetables, pulses and fruits as they give us vitamins and minerals and protect us from diseases. Oh, was this the reason? Okay, Mom. Now onwards, I will always eat green vegetables, pulses and fruits and next year, I will definitely win the first prize. Green vegetables, fruits and pulses give us vitamins and minerals and constitute the protective food. Apart from the energy giving food and bodybuilding food, we also require protective food in our diet. This type of food protects us from deficiency diseases, vitamins and minerals. These are called protective food. There are six types of vitamins. These are vitamin A, 
vitamin B, vitamin C, vitamin D, vitamin E and vitamin K. There are several types of minerals such as calcium, phosphorus, sodium and potassium, fluorine, iodine and iron. Vitamin A helps our eyes and skin healthy. Sources of vitamin A are carrot, tomato, green leafy vegetables like spinach, yellow fruits, milk, butter and fish liver oil. Vitamin B helps in releasing energy and in the formation of red blood cells. Sources for vitamin B are cereals, peas, potatoes, yeast, meat and milk. Vitamin C keeps our teeth, gums and bones healthy. Sources for vitamin C are citrus fruits like lemon, orange, tomato and sprouts. Vitamin D helps in the formation of strong bones and teeth. Sources Sunlight, milk, fish and egg. Vitamin E keeps our body and skin healthy. Sources for vitamin E are peas, milk, eggs and nuts. Vitamin K helps in blood clotting. Sources for vitamin K are spinach, cabbage, eggs and liver. Calcium, phosphorus and fluorine helps in formation of strong bones and teeth. Sources of minerals are milk, cheese, green vegetables, bread, potatoes, eggs, meat and seafood. Sodium and potassium helps in maintaining body's water balance. Sources for sodium and potassium are salt and most foods. Iron helps in formation of red pigment of blood that is hemoglobin. Sources for iron are cereals, pulses, green leafy vegetables, meat, eggs and liver. Iodine helps in proper functioning of thyroid gland. Sources for iodine are seafood and iodized so balanced diet, carbohydrates, fats, proteins, vitamins, minerals, roughage and water taken in adequate quantity make a balanced diet. A balanced diet is essential for us to be free from diseases. If we don't take a balanced diet, we will suffer from deficiency and diseases. Diseases are caused due to deficiency of one or more essential nutrient in the diet. Deficiency Diseases Deficiency of carbohydrates and proteins causes malnutrition. The symptoms of malnutrition are weak and thin child and poor growth. Vitamin A deficiency results in night blindness and the symptom of night blindness is not able to see in dark. Deficiency of vitamin B causes beriberi. Symptom for this disease is weak muscles and nerve disorder. Deficiency of vitamin C causes scurvy and symptom for this disease is bleeding gums. Deficiency of vitamin D causes rickets. In this disease, the bones become soft and bend. Calcium deficiency causes bone and tooth decay. Symptom for this disease is weak bones. Lack of iodine causes goiter. In goiter, the region around the neck swells. Iron deficiency causes anemia and symptom for anemia is weakness. Bodybuilding foods, proteins. Now let us study about the bodybuilding food. Observe the food eaten by boys in frame A and B. After some days, you can see that the boy in frame A is healthy whereas the boy in frame B is not growing well. He is very weak and his skin is getting loose. Children, the difference between the two boys is because of lack of nutrients. 
he is not taking proteins which are referred as body building food the diet of the boy is deprived of proteins proteins are body building food it is required for growth and repair of body tissues regulating body functions and protecting the body from infections there are two sources of protein plant sources and animal sources pulses like soya bean peas green gram cereals like wheat and corn are the plant sources milk eggs paneer cheese fish and meat are the animal sources of protein energy giving foods fats and carbohydrates mohit rohan and sarav are playing football mohit got tired and goes to home he is very exhausted and needs some energy therefore he eats nutritious food like egg sandwich and paneer he gets energy from the energy giving foods that are carbohydrates and fats carbohydrates are of two types that are sugar and starch fats give more energy than carbohydrates the excess of carbohydrates is stored in the body as fats sources of carbohydrates are sugar and starch milk honey candies and chocolates are the sources of sugar while starch can be found in wheat bread rice potatoes and maize sources of fats are also of two types plant sources and animal sources vegetable oils like coconut oil mustard oil cashew nuts almonds and ground nut are plant sources of fats butter cream milk egg fish and meat are the animal sources of fats water and roughage observe the boy and the food items eaten by him the food consists of potatoes oil ghee pulses green vegetables milk and eggs do you think it is sufficient can his diet be called a balanced diet let us find out after keeping on having this diet the boy suffers from stomach ache a doctor comes did you drink water after having your meals and did your meal involve some grain carrot or cabbage i took all the nutrients like carbohydrates fats vitamins minerals and proteins are they not sufficient they are also necessary but along with this there are two more essential nutrients which do not have any nutritive value but are necessary for us these nutrients are roughage and water food groups let us know about the various food groups and their functions food can be categorized into five groups according to the nutrient content these are protective food energy giving food body building food roughage and water